Bridges, can I come in? Yes, you can. All right. How are you doing today? My name is Megan Branch. I'm a student physical therapist assistant. I'm right over there is my aide, Hannah. She's going to be working with us today. How are you feeling? Okay, I'll ask you a few questions about that in a minute. Who have you brought with you? Um, this is my mom. Hello, how are you? Your sister? <laughs> my sister. Okay. <laughs> All right, so are you having any pain today? Uh, yes. Yeah. All right, on a scale of zero to ten, zero being no pain, ten being the worst pain you could possibly have, can you rate your pain for me? Four. That's a four. Okay, and where is your pain located? Your left knee, okay? So, before we get started, can I bring the sheet down? One thing I would like to tell you about is that I don't want this pillow under your knees, okay? So, I don't want your knees or your hips getting tight, okay? Because we're getting you ready for your prosthesis, okay? So, can I take this? Just slide that. Okay. And also, I would like for you to keep the bed as flat as you can. I don't want your hips or your knees getting tight, okay? Uh, <laughs> they may. <laughs> Not sure. I'll lower you down a little bit. So, Mom, try to remind her not to put pillows under her knees and to keep the bed as flat as possible. I don't want her getting tight in the knees or in the hips, okay? So, before we get started, okay. All right. Move this out the way. So I'm going to take some vital signs on you today. Hey, no, you put this now, does she always have to put the bed flat? She, I would like for it to be flat as much as possible, just so she's not tight in the hip. She can have it bent some, but not for long periods of time. Okay. Yeah. Put this on for you. Okay. All right, so I'm going to take, take your blood pressure so you don't feel a squeeze, okay? I'm going to put this on top of you. Is it okay if I put these socks on you? Mm -hmm. Okay. I'm just going to cover up your legs here, okay, just to keep you covered, okay? You're welcome. Alright. you get the numbers, Hannah, already? So I'm gonna go ahead and take this. You get to let me know when you're ready, Hannah. Good to go. Okay. I'm gonna take this off of you. So is it okay if I take a little bit of uh, measurements on your knees today and your hips? Okay. All right. So what I would like for you to do is um, roll to your right side for me, if you can. Well, actually, stay um, on your back for me, okay? Come around here. Now raise your bed up, okay? Okay. 
All right, so the first thing I would like for you to do is, is as far down as you can right, extend your knee. Okay, so what I would like for you to do is bring your, your knee up just like that and bend it, okay? All right, and let it back down. All right, Scott, you're on. All right, so try to push it down as much as you can for me, okay? <coughs> hey, Mr. Ross. My name is Scott Rogers. I'm a student physical therapy assistant. How are you doing today? This is Stephanie from Physical Therapy Aid. We'll be working this out. All right. Who do you have with you today? Uncle. Your uncle? Yeah. Hey, how you doing? Good. All right, so we're going to go through stuff today. Uh, are you in pain today? All right, and I'm starting her at 41 degrees. Uh, where okay. is that pain? All right, and can you go ahead and bend your knee up for me? On a scale from zero to 10, zero being no pain at all, 10 being the worst pain ever, what number would you be? Three. All right, and I have her now at about 91 degrees. Okay. Uh, 41. To 91 degrees of knee flexion, left knee flexion. Okay. All right, Miss Bridges. So if you could, I would like for you to roll to your right side. Can you do that for me? I'll just stand over here. Very good. And so what we're, you can slide a little bit towards me if you can. So what we're going to do next, I want you to straighten out as much as you can. I want you to bring your leg up just like this, okay? All right. And can you do that for me? All right. Lay it back down. So I'm going to put you here and hold it, okay? Don't let me push you down. I'm applying minimal resistance, moderate resistance, <coughs> mod to max. All right, so I would give her a four for abductors. All right, Miss Bridges, next thing we're going to do is let your leg just rest in my hand. I want you to bring your leg back just like that, okay? All right. And can you do that for me? All right. And can you bring it back and hold it? Don't let me push you back, OK? I'm applying minimal resistance, moderate resistance. All right. So if she broke it mod, I'll give her a three plus. All right. And you can go ahead and roll back on your back for me, OK? So. Take this sheet off of you. So I'm done testing the range of motion for you today. So we're going to get up out of the bed today and get in the wheelchair, okay? Wiggle this around. All right, Hannah, will you go around there for me? <coughs> So, Ms. Bridges, can you um, roll to your right side for me? Well, actually, just stay, sorry, not roll, just stand right there. Walk yourself up with your elbows and your arms for me if you can. All right. All right, and can you walk yourself around towards me? So, um, walk your arms this way. There you go. Very good. And we tie her in the back. She's been trying to get out of bed. I've been trying to. she? Her. We're going to work She'll with her. She's waiting on y'all. Oh, okay. We're going to get moving today. I don't want okay. you laying in the bed, okay? Okay. Again, a little hard headed. Oh. This leg ain't going to stop me. We got to keep moving, okay? All right, she tied Hannah. Sorry, yet. Make sure I'm tied good. We're going out in the hallway. I want anybody to <laughs> see my <laughs> Put this around you just so I can keep a good 
good hold of you. Is that too tight? No, it's okay. Okay. Uh, just hold it in there for me. All right. Just keep holding her, Hannah. <coughs> Okay, move this right here. Is not locked very well. Okay, can I have her? If you would, this, these wheels aren't locking very well. So what I want you to do is stand behind the wheelchair and hold it. Yeah. So what I want you to do, Miss Bridges, is try sliding forward for me. Very good. And I want you to push your right leg under you as much as you can. Okay, and I want you to lean forward. And you're gonna use your arms and your right leg, mm -hmm. and I want you to stand up mm -hmm. and pivot to the wheelchair, okay? And Hannah's holding the wheelchair. It's not locking very well today. So she's, we got you, okay? Okay. So lean forward. Okay. And on the count of three, I want you to stand up and pivot to the wheelchair. Okay. All right, one, two, three. Stand up and pivot. There we go. How you doing? Oh, it feels good to get yeah, out of that bed. Right. There we go. Okay. All right. Hannah, will you come get the lines for me? You can lead the way, Hannah. Would you like me to take your kids up? Yes, please. Okay. <coughs> All right, can we just go to that first line? Yep. And we'll stop there, okay? okay. Yeah. yeah, right there. Right. So Hannah, what I'm gonna get you to do when I get her to stand up, I'm gonna have you stand behind the wheelchair again, okay? okay. It's still kind of wiggling. Okay. I don't like that. Do you need to be on this side? Um, you can just stay where you are, that's fine. Miss Bridges, so we're going to stand up from the wheelchair. Are we going to walk into that? We are. We're going to walk with the crutches. Are you excited about that? I am. All right. We're going to practice walking on level surfaces, on curbs, and stairs, okay? okay. So right That's now, <laughs> what I'm going to teach you now is how to stand up from the wheelchair. So I want you to put the crutches on the left side and put your hand on the inside. Okay. And I want you to lean forward just like we did in the bed. Lean and scoot forward. And I want you to put your right leg underneath you as much as possible, okay? You do. Mom, <laughs> <laughs> I want you to 